Just a reminder that everything you see here on Gamers on Games is made possible by patrons like you. Why not check out our Patreon page? It would really help us out. Hi, I'm Andrew Parks from Quixotic Games. This is Mike. Hello. And we're showing off Dungeon Alliance today. This is a game that was a Kickstarter. Um, and then when it went to uh, the retail market, we sold out all of our copies in a, in a couple of weeks. So there are some copies still online right now. And we're getting ready to do a second Kickstarter. Uh, so it's a deck building game with uh, miniatures. So it's dungeon crawl and deck building together. You have a little deck of cards that represents your entire alliance. Each player has their own little alliance here. And you can either play the game competitively, and you can actually play PvP so that you explore this dungeon, and when you get to the middle, you start beating each other up. Or you could play cooperatively where you're both trying to conquer the dungeon together. You can also play solo, so you can play by yourself and have a solo map. Um, and as you play, you have these upgrades that match your characters. So if you look at my four characters here, you know, if I wanted to draft one of these cards, like to draft adaptable, I'd need to have a half-orc or a human. So if I look here at their symbols, I don't have any humans, but I have one half-orc, so Graltar could use that, so that would be great. Um, so this would require me to have somebody with a priest symbol, and I've got, this guy's a full priest, they have a little bit, but he's a monk, so he's got that symbol, she's a scholar, so all three of them could use that card. So I could draft that card, it would go into my hand, and now I'd be able to play it on one of my other characters. And so you keep playing as you conquer monsters, you get experience points, you use the experience points to buy these cards. Uh, and whoever has the most experience points at the end wins the game. Very cool, very cool. Just a reminder that everything you see here on Gamers on Games is made possible by patrons like you. Why not check out our Patreon page? It would really help us out.